Here are the most recent deaths in the national news. Who Died Today America is your daily source where you can find any obituary in America and beyond. Luan Jardim, a renowned fitness influencer, died tragically at the age of 30 during an attempted carjacking on May 21, 2023. Known for her transformation as an ex-obese individual, Jardim was a beacon of inspiration for over 350,000 followers on Instagram, where she dispensed exercise advice and shared her personal weight loss journey. The brutal incident unfolded in Rio de Janeiro, where she was caught in gunfire while spending time with her family. Her family is adamant that her path won't be marred by tragedy, asserting that she was a radiant presence who impacted countless lives through her fitness coaching and lifestyle inspiration. The ripple effects of Jardim's life work continue to influence the fitness and health industry, underscoring the importance of personal strength and resilience. Floyd Newman, the iconic baritone saxophonist integral to the Stax record sound, passed away on May 23rd, 2023 at age 92. Collaborating with legends such as B.B. King, Sam Cooke, Otis Redding, and Aretha Franklin, Newman's signature saxophone tone has left an indelible mark on soul music, particularly with the Marquis' instrumental hit, Last Night. Having introduced talents like Booker T. Jones and Isaac Hayes to Stax Records, Newman's influence extends beyond his musical contributions. His legacy will forever echo in the annals of music history. Chaz Newby, a key figure in the Beatles' early history, sadly passed away on May 23, 2023 at age 81. Having been a part of John Lennon's original band, The Quarrymen, and later serving as the Beatles' first left-handed bassist, Newby's impact on the band's evolution and success was significant. His ongoing dedication to music, shown through his performances with The Quarrymen from 2016 onward, coupled with his warm nature, made him an enduringly beloved figure. Newby's multifaceted contributions to The Beatles will forever be a part of the band's history, inspiring future musicians and music lovers. Eric Polemer, an influential Chilean poet and media figure, passed away on May 22, 2023 at the age of 68. Known for his contributions to the generation of the 80s in Chilean literature, Paul Ammer was a man of many talents. His significant works, such as Virginis de Chile, earned him prestigious awards like the Pablo Neruda Award and the Santiago Municipal Literature Award. Paul Ammer's contributions to literature, as well as his presence in media and pop culture, have left a lasting impact on the literary scene in Chile and beyond. Mike Carey, a respected British radio presenter and journalist, passed away on May 20, 2023, at the age of 87, following a tragic accident. Beginning his career at the Derby Telegraph, Carey later found a faithful audience on BBC Radio Derby, hosting memorable melodies for nearly 20 years. Known for his dedication to the Derbyshire cricket scene, Carey reported on cricket in countries around the world, contributing to numerous publications. His influence in local journalism and broadcasting particularly in the world of cricket, will leave a lasting legacy in the Derbyshire community and the wider field of sports journalism. Jean Hawdry, a luminary in the field of linguistics and comparative mythology, passed away just shy of his 89th birthday on May 23, 2023. Best known as a professor of linguistics and Sanskrit at the University of Lyon III, Hawdry's pivotal contributions, particularly his groundbreaking work in Sanskrit, and the reconstruction of ancient Indo-European language have shaped the academic sphere of Indo-European languages. His unique interpretations in comparative mythology, showcased in his major work, La Religion Cosmique des Indo-Européens, will continue to stimulate scholarly thought and discussion. Audrey's enduring legacy in linguistics and mythology will inspire generations to come. Charles Francis Cotton Nash, an American sports legend renowned for his exceptional tenure in Major League Baseball and the National Basketball Association, passed away at age 80 on May 23, 2023, earning first-team All-American honors in 1964 while at the University of Kentucky. Nash went on to create a unique legacy as one of only 13 athletes to play in both the NBA and MLB. Notable for his contributions to teams such as the Los Angeles Lakers, the San Francisco Warriors, the Chicago White Sox, and Minnesota Twins, 
Nash's passing marks the end of a distinguished era. His contributions to multi-sport athletics will be remembered and celebrated by fans and players alike. Robert J. Zimmer, the transformative leader and 13th president of the University of Chicago, passed away at age 75 on May 23, 2023. Zimmer made remarkable contributions to the university's scholarly eminence, including the establishment of the university's first engineering program. Known for fostering an environment conducive to intellectual exploration and diversity of thought, Zimmer's vision will continue to shape the university's future. His four-decade-long service at the university and trailblazing work in mathematics will forever be remembered. Claude Knoll, former world lightweight boxing champion, passed away on May 21, 2023 at age 74. The Tobago-born sportsman rocketed to global fame when he secured the vacant WBA World Lightweight title in 1981, defeating Rodolfo Gonzalez in a memorable bout in Atlantic City. Despite adversities in retirement, including health issues, Noel remained a symbol of national pride, reflected in the Claude Noel Highway, named in his honor in Tobago. With an impressive career tally of 31 wins in 41 professional fights, his journey from selling fruits to becoming a world champion embodies resilience and indomitable spirit. His legacy as a champion and resilient fighter will forever be etched in the annals of boxing history, inspiring future generations. John Loveday, former All Blacks Lock, passed away on May 20, 2023, at age 74. A stalwart of New Zealand rugby, Loveday was part of the All Blacks squad that toured Great Britain and Ireland in 1978. Despite an early injury, Loveday's determination saw him return to the field and contribute to the Manawatu's successful Ranfurly Shield reign. His courage and commitment, even when facing adversities like fracturing two vertebrae, remain a testament to his passion for rugby. Loveday's legacy in New Zealand rugby, one of grit, commitment, and undeniable talent, will always be remembered as an integral part of the All Black squad of 1978. Venezuelan cellist and composer Paul Desen passed away on May 20, 2023, at the age of 63, due to a heart attack. A prominent figure in the fusion of Latin American and European music, Desen's contributions to the world of classical music are immense. His compositions like Hypnosis Mariposa have been performed worldwide in major venues such as Alice Tully Hall at the Lincoln Center for the Performing Arts and the Weill Recital Hall at Carnegie Hall. Descend's pioneering and unique compositional style has left an enduring impact on the classical music industry, bridging cultural gaps and creating a rich musical tapestry. Alois Tkach, the revered Emeritus Archbishop of Kosice, passed away on May 23rd. His dedicated service as a priest, chaplain, and later as an archivist at the bishop's office in Kosice has left a lasting impression on the Archdiocese of Kosice. Despite facing challenges during his journey, Tkach remained undeterred, serving as the Archbishop of Kosice and Metropolitan from 1995. His passing is mourned deeply, and his impactful contributions to the Church will continue to inspire future generations. David Pollock, renowned British humanist and former president of the European Humanist Federation, EHF, passed away on May 12, 2023, at the age of 81 due to cancer. Pollock had a profound influence on human rights and secularism during his tenure at the EHF, where he campaigned for equality within European and international institutions. His work at Action on Smoking and Health, and later as the author of Denial and Delay, The Political History of Smoking and Health, 1951-1964, showcased his commitment to public health. Remembered for his passion in addressing conflicts between laws on equality and religious beliefs, Pollock's legacy as a champion of humanism and non-discrimination continues to inspire the humanist community. Lyudmila Kovnatskaya, a distinguished Russian musicologist and professor at the St. Petersburg State Conservatoire, passed away on May 9, 2023 at the age of 82. Celebrated for her significant contributions to the field of music, Kovnatskaya authored a prominent monograph about Benjamin Britten and made substantial research contributions to the history of Russian music. Through her relentless efforts, 
numerous festivals and concerts honoring classic English music were brought to fruition. Kovnatskaya's meticulous and groundbreaking work, which spanned over the oeuvre of many notable composers, has left an unforgettable mark on musicology, fostering deeper understanding and appreciation of both Russian and English music. Enrico Olduini, a notable Italian director and screenwriter, passed away at age 77 on May 10, 2023. With a career that began in the 70s, Olduini proved himself as a key figure in the Italian film industry, particularly in the comedy genre. He debuted as a film director in 1984, and many of his films were major box office successes. His impact on Italian cinema, especially comedy films, is a lasting legacy that will continue to influence future generations of Italian filmmakers. Marc Junio, a pioneer in Belgian live sports reporting, died on May 5, 2023 at the age of 95. Junio initiated his career in journalism with Le Pupil and was one of the first sports journalists to transition to live television reporting in Belgium. He created the program Lundi Sports, which remained on air for a quarter of a century. His pioneering work in the field of live sports reporting and his significant contributions to the written press have left a memorable mark on Belgian sports journalism. Stanley Engerman, an influential American economist and economic historian, died on May 11, 2023, at the age of 87. Known for his quantitative historical work, Engerman made significant contributions to our understanding of American history, including his co-authored work, Time on the Cross, The Economics of American Negro Slavery, which won the Bancroft Prize. His teachings at the University of Rochester and his impactful research have made a profound and lasting impact on the field of economic history. Heidi Forster, the renowned Swiss actress, has passed away on May 2, 2023, at the age of 91. Forster, born in Basel in 1931, was known for her natural charm and versatile acting skills. She began her career at the Zurich Schauspielhaus and later starred in popular Swiss films such as Hinter den Sieben Gleisen and Es Doc Überem Chopf. Forster's lively performances and her ability to captivate audiences with her unique persona made her a cherished figure in the Swiss film industry. Her legacy endures as she continues to inspire upcoming artists with her illustrious career. Thank you for watching. If you found these tributes meaningful, don't forget to give a thumbs up and hit the notification bell. We would love to hear your thoughts in the comments section below. Also, let us know who inspired you the most.